I focus on food, fitness, and freedom all together with you. Come join me as I set up my day and share these three recipes with you right now. Hey, it's Dory, and it is tonight. So before we go any further, I'm going to set up my tomorrow tonight. So let's go. Let's get started with gratitude. I like to start the day in gratitude. So I'm grateful for old trauma resurfacing. It allows me to continue healing. I can sit with it and heal. I'm not afraid. I am safe. I then move on to my goal for the day. It's so important for me not only to be efficient, but to be effective in this world. Moving on to my food and fitness, I map out my most favorite recipes. I'll make sure to link them in this video and my fitness routine for a total of 45 minutes. I then jot down some notes that I had regarding our family reunion for 2023 to make it special and fun. Remember, I am grateful because I am efficient and effective. In terms of food, us Bright Line Eaters love a food promise, but don't be afraid to change a meal if you notice you have food to use up. Moving on, let's get the schedule underway, starting in the morning with Habit Stacks and my sauna. Then I start work and continue work split into part one and part two. I make sure to do only the must-dos and be very flexible in terms of what actually gets done. Then I make sure to get that 45-minute fitness routine in and date night and then my evening habit stacks. The most important priority for me today is to get these meetings running on time. My to-do list used to be super long. Now I make sure to have no more than five things. I'm trying to get it to three. My special moment of the day and daily review will happen later. Remember, my friends, when you make your statement, I am grateful, add the because. And remember to be efficient and effective in this world. And don't be afraid to make a change. Last but not least, make sure that you remember your special moment of the day and do a quick review so you know what works and what doesn't work for the future. Everyone's different. Do what works for you. Good morning, it's time for breakfast. So we have this blueberry breakfast bake, which is my viral blueberry breakfast bake. The bake that started it all. It's got 55K views all over my social media platforms and it's super easy to make. Check out the recipe in the caption. Taco bowl. It is time for lunch. Ah. Let's have a little fun with it. Let's make it. Leftover peppers, leftover onion, leftover cauliflower rice. Beyond beef that I made, leftover, let's use it. Cheese. Cebollas. So you're gonna let all of this just sort of steam up into the air, right? So that the flavors can be like, boom. Now that the aromas are, whoop, cauliflower rice. Get it in there, get it all in there. I don't know why I'm holding the spatula this way. I really don't. I think it's because I'm filming. It's a whole different vibe when you're filming. Okay, good. Let's zhuzh it up. I'm feeling a little... Vamos, let's do it. Repeat after me. I'm extra. <laughs> That's a whole lot of pa' que lo sepa. Mira, cumin. I like it. I like it. This is going to be good. This looks pretty done. We're going to move it over to the side and get our Beyond Beef on the other side. All right, I've already measured out four ounces. I made this a couple of days ago. Let's put it in here. Huepa. <laughs> Take your Beyond Beef. You're gonna put it right on top of your mixture. One ounce of cheese, sprinkle it on top. We're gonna cover it. I like this top because it has a little space and that way my cheese won't stick to the top. Here it is. So good and so filling. Like, oh my God. So good. Busy day, date night done, 20 minute dinner, let's go. All right, here's what's going down. I'm gonna make veggie soup with rotini in 20 minutes. Get your water boiling, add your pasta. Get out your frozen vegetables and air fry them. Take a small saucepan and add some veggie broth. Us Bright Line eaters typically do four to eight ounces, which aligns with our eating. Pasta's cooking. This is garbanzo bean pasta. Veggies are roasting. Broth is low temperature, just heating itself up. Wash the face. This is a 20 minute dinner. 
Now, before you plate this, add a little seasoning to your broth if you like to make it extra. I like it a bit spicy. Put your pasta in a bowl, add your veggies, and here we go. Warm and comforting broth over your veggies and pasta. Finish it off with one ounce of Parmesan cheese, sprinkling it all over and enjoy. And like I like to say, bright appetit, you know, instead of bon appetit. Listen, buen provecho and enjoy. Hi, my name is Dory and thank you for stopping by. My channel focuses on food, fitness and freedom. Food. I create and develop recipes that are no sugar, no flour. Fitness. I present fitness classes, workshops, and events in person and virtually, and we'll do that together here. Freedom. As I'm on my own journey towards freedom after losing 80 pounds, you're with me here. So that means we'll go through it all together. I hope and pray that this video that you're watching here now blesses you in some kind of way and gives you hope. See you soon.